All right, a real quick video for all you guys still running on M uh, 5.00 M33-6. This is the uh, LEDA Leda. Um, the uh, it's basically a 1.50 kernel plug-in for your custom firmware. So I'm just going to show you how to install it real quick. It's real simple, real easy. So um, yeah, I'm going to do this with a PSP Fat model because this is the only fucking one that I have M33 on right now. And I don't feel like using the Hellcat recovery flash to flash all the way down to 5.00 M33-6 because one, it takes too much time, and two, I already have one on it and I don't feel like doing it to my PSP Slim because it's my baby. So anyways, let's get to it and uh, that's about it. So yeah, um, here we go with the 1.50 kernel called Leda for 5.00 M33-6. Here we go. Alright, so here we are at the PSP. And uh, of course I don't have the ultimate VSH menu, so I can't block my MAC address. But here I am, 5.00 M33-6, that's my firmware. Right, anyways. Um, yeah, so uh, basically what we're just going to do now is take a USB cable and connect it to the PSP. And then come to the computer. Alright, so the file I'm going to have you download is right here, the 25917leta01.zip. <clears throat> uh, if you don't have an extraction program, right click on this and it say extract all to your desktop. If you do, just double click on it. I recommend using WinRAR because it's just like really easy. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so I uh, just open that up, minimize that out the way. Uh. on I really need a new computer there we go close all right so inside that you're gonna see a readme text and a leda all in capitals folder and if you open the later folder you will see the eboot.pvp and the iop.prx so uh, go back and just so you see the uh, later um, or the leda all caps folder open up my computer <clears throat> and go to the removable drive for your PSP open up the PSP folder and then open up the regular game folder and simply all you're gonna do right now is take the LEDA folder from the extraction program of the extracted files and drag and drop that into the PSP game folder all right now, you can exit that, and minimize that, and come back to the PSP. Alright, back at the PSP, we're going to exit USB mode here and scroll over to the game. And you will see the Lita Legacy Software Loader. Alright, anyways, so start that up. Alright, so it'll finish in about like a split second, like legit. And uh, that's about it. That's all you really gotta do. And yeah. So now you have the 1.50 kernel installed in 5.00 M33 6 custom firmware. So yeah, that's how you install the 5.00 uh, uh, M33 6 1.50 kernel. Um, called LEDA um, or LEDA or whatever you want to call it uh, you got yeah so um, it's about it really simple takes about a second um, so uh, you got any questions leave me a comment on this video send me a message if you uh, have any recommendations for any other videos that you would like to see on my channel just leave me a comment on my channel page right there um, subscribe to my channel to uh, stay up to date with my videos and such forth and um, yeah, other than that, I will have the link to this file underneath more information on this video. And um, that's about it. So I hope uh, you guys that are still on M33 and using the Yabuza um, or whatever the fuck they're called. I, for I forgot the name of them because I don't use them anymore. The uh, converters for your games for uh, 6.00, 6.10, and 6.20 firmwares. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so take it easy, guys. Hope this helps you. Talk to you later.